Hey, what's up guys? So I thought I'd make a fast video here. Um, I've been putting it off for a couple days because I didn't know how YouTube would react. But a couple nights ago, probably after midnight or so, <clears throat> my camera went off and the outside of my fence in my backyard. And I thought maybe it was a wild animal or something. Because we have a lot of beers around here. So I decided to go out. <clears throat> take the gavel out there in case it was a wild animal see how it would react to getting a shot with it to scare it off with the noise and all and <clears throat> it wasn't an animal it was actually a person now this person was big he was a tall dude i mean i'm talking at least seven feet tall uh Big guy, probably about 260, 270, trying to open up my gate to my backyard. Um, I ain't gonna lie, I kind of froze for a split second there. Is that's not what I was expecting? But once I went out there, I charged this up. I asked Dude what he was doing. I already knew what he was doing, but I wanted to see if he'd take off running or not before I had to use this. And Lo and behold, son of a bitch turned around and just gave me that look. And I backed up and he came forward. Well, I shot him in the chest once. Dude fell about halfway down before he caught his balance. He was breathing kind of not too good. Kind of uh, kind of like he had asthma. You could tell he was in a shitload of pain. But he got up again, or the first time he got up. And I shot him again. This time I went for his abdominal area. He went down. He went down. He did not get up. I was there for about five minutes. Pointing it at him. I had three shots left. And once he was able to get up after about maybe five, ten minutes, somewhere in between there. He, I thought he was going to come at me again. I told him, dude, you're about to get shot a third time. Don't play around with me. You know, and... Dude turned around and he was kind of stumbling real slow, walking away until he gained his balance and he took off running. Dude never came back. So this gavel here, I'm telling you guys, it'll take down a big boy. Uh, that gut shot really got him. It, it knocked the wind out of him. Um, I'm pretty sure after his adrenaline started wearing off, he felt that chest shot too. So, you know, those who say you need more than five rounds with this thing, I highly doubt it. Um, I was not expecting that. I was not expecting to be a person trying to open up my back gate. I don't know what he was trying to do. There's nothing to steal in my backyard. Um, all I can imagine, he was, he was going to try to come in the back door thinking no one was home or asleep. I have no clue. I don't really care at that point. You're trying to break my gate alone. That's going to cost money. You're on my property. Um... So, like I said, anyone who says you need more than five shots with this thing, putting out around 40 joules, second shot around, it all the varies, 37, 38 joules, is going to put a person down. So, thought I'd make this video let you guys know, this thing, whoo, it works. Now, I have no doubt at all with my burner that that would have worked. Um, like I said, with the burner, I'm going for the face only, and I'm going to be using pepper rounds in that bad boy, but this thing here, two shots, one to two shots, it's all it's going to take. Dude wasn't as big as he was, wasn't as tall as he was. I'm pretty sure one shot would have been all it did if, if the guy was more skinny, but, um, yeah, the gavel is where it's at. This is what you guys need. Like, share, subscribe. Thanks for watching.